Hey, I am, I'm seriously thrilled to be here with the creator and the director of the Human Centipede franchise. It's being franchised almost like McDonald's now. I, actually, I just met your sister and we were thinking maybe tie-ins with McDonald's, maybe a centipede Happy Meal. That's a great idea, I love it. Maybe we could grow uh, yeah, as big as McDonald's one day. That would be perfect. I think it's becoming a cultural thing. And, and your name, you are the bodyguard for, uh, for Mr. Six? Yes, bodyguard servant, don't mess with him. Okay, I wouldn't mess with many, I just a human centipede, it's terrifying. What, what are your expectations uh, for, for any of these films? Are you, are you the guy that kind of likes to see your movies or you're kind of terrified, you want to run? I love to see the audience reactions. I'm a, I'm a quite uh, psychotic, uh, yeah, psychotic guy, so I love to see all the reactions. I had people vomiting in theaters. Lovely. Yeah, lovely, and I can't wait uh, what this audience is going to be. Maybe it'll be a diarrhea film. Maybe it'll uh, attack. Hey, Dieter, come over here. Let's get you with together with your. Let's let's get you here real quick, because this is the this is the shot. These two guys. What's it like working with Tom Six? Just honestly, honestly love him, hate him. What do you you, you want an honest oh, answer? One, just once, yes. Yes, he's a genius, and the best director I had in my long, short life. Uh, at my tender age, I. I had a lot of directors, Oscar winners, Cannes winners, uh, Venice, yeah. uh, uh, Venice, yeah. Venice, yeah. Yeah. Venice, Venice winners, yeah. but he is the best I met in my whole career. And this guy is one of the best actors around. He's an amazing actor. This is a very... I yeah. Yes. I hope this man is recognized by the whole world as a genius as well. Well, I, I think you're both geniuses, and I think, you know, the, this is an interesting part, too, because you are obviously have an accent, and you're playing someone uh, now yeah, in, in a... That's is it, the beauty of it. I'm a German-American <laughs> who grew up in Schweinfurt. Schweinfurt, huh? Yes. Yeah. And, uh, and uh, that's so, so beautiful. I don't have to care a shit about my accent. I can do an accent worse, <laughs> much worse than Kissinger. So Who has the heavier accent, that's you think? My, between the two of you? Uh, maybe even I. I. I'm terrible at English, so, uh, but I think it's a part of the charm, don't you think? Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, uh, do you ever, I mean, we're going to find out if you ever wind up in a centipede, uh, but obviously I think there's a lot of fans that want to see uh, you and Lawrence Harvey actually join the centipede. Is that a, a poss possibility? Uh, By the time this interview comes out, the movie will already... Yeah. sweet idea, but uh, I can't confirm that yet because you have to watch the film to find out. Yeah. Uh, are there other films that you're interested... Obviously, you've had a, how many years? A decade of the Centipede films between the two of you? A decade, right? Uh, a decade? No. I mean, not a decade. Yeah. Four years. 2009, four or five years? Yeah, yeah. yeah between yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you ever get sick of seeing people on their knees and... Shiting? Oh, Did Jesus get tired of bleeding? Never. Ever. Absolutely no. I can not get uh, enough of this. You guys seem so happy to enjoy the uh, actual uh, uh, films that you do. What, what makes these films so much fun? I'm going to ask him. I'm his bodyguard servant. That's all I'll say. Okay. And what would you say about why you have the desire to make movies with people defecating in each other's mouths. Well, the secret is that everybody has his own fantasy with it. Eh? You, can, you can place yourself in a situation and, and think, what would I do if I would be in the middle or something? So you can imagine your friends in a position like that. So everybody can enjoy it. Yeah, people you work with, you want to see them. What, what would it be like to have family members oh, taped and tied to each other? How about you, Dieter? The old saying was, crime and sex sells. The new saying will be, poop, crime, and sex sells. That's the new. If I ever heard a great tagline to an interview, I, I think that's it. Will there be a, will there be a centipede four? Uh, not for now. I, I intended it to be a trilogy, because it makes a, a human movie centipede now. But if I would have to make a fourth one, maybe in 20 years, yeah. it'd have to be about a charity organization uh, putting together all starving Africans to save the hunger problems in the world. With the centipede? Yeah, imagine that. Uh, I, I can't actually, but it's an interesting thought. Is there anything before we go that you would like to ask Tom Six that you've never asked him before? No questions at all. And Tom, is there anything you'd like to ask Dieter? We, we talk so much with each other. We're we know pretty much sick of each other. Yeah, no, not sick, not at all. We love each other. Is there anything you would like to ask? I'm his bodyguard servant. That's all I'll say for now. We talk 
very little during work, but we talk a lot before we start working. And therefore, each, both know from what, I know what he wants me to do, and he knows how I will play it. So it's actually without words we work. And we don't do as, we do as less as possible yes. rehearsals. Minimal. Avoid rehearsals. I like that. Just go in in the cold water. So to speak, just go, swim. Yeah. Just get, get on your knees and, and swallow. The Absolutely. only guy, yeah. uh, when I call at, at night my wife, I say, he's speaking the one clap man. But the only director in the world where I am able to do a lot of things with one clap. And that makes me proud. And that's the clapper when the take starts. Well, listen, we're thrilled for the movie. I'm his bodyguard servant. That's all I'll say for now. And that's all we have from here, from the, uh, from the wonderful theater, seeing the Human Centipede 3. Thanks, guys. You're Thank awesome. You. I believe bringing back medieval torture methods. <laughs> Our prison has the highest violence rates, legal and medical costs, than any other institution in the U.S. correctional system. Things will have to change fast. I think I have a solution. No more prison fights. No more assaults on guards. No more disrespect. We've got to make a human centipede of our prisoners. They will literally be on their knees begging for your mercy. It's brilliant! Mr. Tom Six, creator of these films, claims that it's 100% medically accurate. I don't speak with a stupid filmmaker about his poop fetish. What do you think, Doc? It looks... Medically accurate. I don't see why someone couldn't survive a lifetime. Peace on earth, uh, goodwill to men. This is a violation of human rights. It's certainly a violation of federal ethics. You insane freaks will get the death penalty. This is beyond medieval torture, beyond castration, the ultimate correction. First human prison centipede. This is exactly what America needs. <laughs>